love watching what's in my purse videos so I decided um, since I didn't really have a video going up today I am going to do a what's in my purse kind of a video it's been ages since I uh, did one of these and I thought you know what it's due time. So I'm going to introduce my hand-me-down purse here that I got. It's broken in, but it's brand new to me. When I was home in Newfoundland, my mom's friend was giving away a bunch of her clothes and purses, and I was like, dibs, I'm going to dig through that. And I found this purse. I was like, I am taking that home with me. So I have no idea where she got it. I have no idea how old it is or what. That is some Italian name or something on it. It's a uh, nice saddle brown bag. It can zip up on the sides here. And it has one of these zippers here where sometimes I put my keys if I'm going out. You know, I just want easy access to it. And um, yeah. So here is what the purse looks like right now. Yep. It's uh, really organized. Like I never have junk in my purse because I can't stand when I'm digging through and then I can't find my wallet or my keys or something like that. So it is pretty clean for the most part and I'm going to dive right in and show you guys what I got first. Always need a hairbrush. This one is from H&M. I ordered it online a couple of weeks ago and uh, I got the bigger size version too but this one I wanted for my purse because I always need to brush my hair because it's scraggly. It gets scraggly so easy. So there's that. And now I have a fancy pair of sunglasses. Uh, these are Ray-Bans. I think they're men's. I don't know. How do you even tell the name of them? The RB4125s? Or is it Cats 5000? I don't know. I don't know. So I love these so much. They do leave kind of a dent like right here. And then once my face gets sweaty, they uh, slide down a little bit. But I do love them and they protect my eyeballs. I have my Blackberry, I will never give it up. They have, they take amazing photos. Like a lot of my blog post photos are mainly these photos. Um, I think this is the Z10, Z10, Z10. However you pronounce it, that's how what it is. And that's what I got there. I got a little chocolate and oh my gosh, it was so good. It was like Werther's Original plus Cappuccino mixed into one. So it's called Copico Cappuccino mini coffee. Uh, I got it at a little nail salon. I have my car keys here and everything on it is climber based like this is an ATC device, play device, carabiner and then another piece of a actual cam. So if you guys are climbers you know what that is. What else? Oh yes! Oh my god I didn't know I had this in here I swear! Okay. <laughs> Um, Ghirardelli chocolate, they give out the minis every time you visit the store, and uh, sometimes I do loops and just get more minis. This one is uh, milk chocolate, sea salt, and almond. I know why it's not eaten yet, because I hate salty chocolate. So that's that. I have a backup of my Blackberry battery. Here's my wallet that I bought at the outlets in New York. Buffalo, New York. Uh, Michael Kors one. It's held up pretty decently. I got it in 2013. Um, and inside I only have like a couple of cards and some American cash. Look my Canadian friends, it's American. So I'm getting to the point now where I can kind of tell what are, like at quick glance, you know, because they all look the same and I'm not handing over a dollar instead of a $20 bill. Um, I can kind of tell now what ones I need to hand in. That means I'm a true American now. <laughs> so that is there. Oh, I have a, oh yeah, I need that. Okay, that's a gift card for Baskin Robbins. My points cards for Sandwich Spot, which is really good sandwich place. Boulevard Coffee, which has amazing espresso drinks. I'm two, four, five away from a free coffee. I got some Starbucks gift cards there. I don't go to Starbucks often because I prefer to go to, ooh, I have a McDonald's uh, free Happy Meal, yes, and then a Sassy Nail for El Camino, Real, Santa Clara Nail Station type of thing, and then the rest are just boring cards, so that's what's in my wallet, and then in here, to keep everything consolidated, 
it's this little pouch that I got from Paul and Chloe. Uh, I'll link their website down below. Um, but this is, oh, it kind of matches, look. I didn't even try that. I'm telling you, man, I'm always about the neutral colors, right? So it's kind of like a little snake skin, little pouch for your purse. Inside, I always keep a lip balm. This is the fancy looking one. It's, I think, Italian, but I got it at the store called Home in St. John's, Newfoundland. Um, it's like a $9 lip balm. Uh, what is it? It's a natural lip balm with SPF 15 and has moisturizing protective with jojoba oil and shea butter. And so that's what it looks like. Lip balm break. I love it. It's like my favorite lip balm. I have a, a couple of favorites. This is one of my favorites. Always have to have a pack of tissues because sometimes you go to the bathroom and then there's no toilet paper. Also because blowing your nose. I have some mints that are really good. Uh, I got these from REI. I can't find them anywhere else. And then you need a um, membership to shop at REI and it costs like $30. I'm not going to pay $30 to get a membership so I could buy these. I can't find them anywhere. They're really good though. Uh, Trader Joe's has green tea mints but they taste really green tea instead of minty. So I don't like them as much. I always bring a hand sanitizer with me. This is the freshly picked tangerines. Smells delicious because uh, I'm always out on the go. And then finally I have, uh, this is it. Oh, that's it? Okay. A Tokyo Milk Dark hand cream that smells amazing. This is a really good product too. So that's what's in that little pouch. Anything else? I have a grocery list. I have to buy birthday cards. And, oh, there's a zipper pocket in here. $20 bill? I had that like stashed away. That's so wicked. <laughs> oh my god. Save that for a rainy day, hey? That's awesome. That's all that's in my hand-me-down purse that I got from my friend in Newfoundland. That's all I got for today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the quick video and thumbs up for more vlogs. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and everywhere else. I'll link everything below. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!